On this episode, we celebrate the Inn at Irwin Gardens, and we talk about how you can enjoy Columbus's most historic home. to celebrate Whoa. property in the Inn at Irwin Gardens is special to Columbus and it's where a lot of Columbus has come from. I mean the Irwin family obviously brought a lot to Columbus with the you know Irwin Union Bank. Um, Clessie Cummins, the family chauffeur obviously, he was the idea behind the motor and then the Irwin family money was what allowed Cummins to come into existence and it all really really happened right here. I think that the Miller family opening the gardens to the public has been a big part of Columbus and a special and I can't tell you how many people say to me, oh, I, when I was a kid I used to come and the elephant and um, I have, you know, pictures of, you know, when I was a, a little girl or boy and, um, and then they bring their kids and their grandchildren and um, that is special. Uh, I also think that it's just extraordinary in the fact that it's just been so well preserved, it's such a neat artifact. And, piece of history as far as, you know, the decor and the architecture and um, I mean the family was just so thoughtful as far as really keeping things intact, you know, kind of probably updating as times changed but also kept a lot of the history of the property. And obviously the foresight that they had in 1910 when they put the gardens in and acquired the city block um, and have maintained it and really kept it original. So I think on lots of different levels, it's a special place. Whenever they walk through the front door, not only are they amazed by the grandeur of the home, but also it's welcoming. It's warming, it's inviting. Uh, all of the end staff goes above and beyond to make sure that each guest is welcomed um, as if they are kind of stepping into someone else's home. Um, but what makes it so special is the history that has occurred here as well. So not only do I have people that travel out of state to come here or even out of the country, I think local people should partake in what this house has done for this town. I mean, Columbus wouldn't be on the map that it is without this family. This family has brought a lot of um, famous architects as, as well as um, revenue to this town. Um, we wouldn't be here or we wouldn't be as significant as we are today without them. Taking care of this really important garden is a, it's an honor for me and uh, I mean it's, it's a wonderful experience to be a part of. I, I couldn't imagine doing anything else right now with my life and I mean I, I hope that some way I, I have a, a stamp on this property a little bit I guess. If you're a first time guest here I would definitely recommend seeing the elephant which is right behind me. Um, this whole area here especially how we have the new design with the plantings and everything. Um, it's really going to create a different experience here than we've had in, in probably 50 years, I believe, with the property, uh, especially with a lot of the flowering plants that we have and stuff. Um, the other areas I would highly always recommend is up underneath the wisteria where the pergolas are, um, especially in the springtime when the wisteria is blooming and all the, the perennials are coming up out of those beds. Um, they're, they're wonderful places to go see and sit and kind of relax a little bit. They, 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 each space has its own unique kind of life to it and you kind of feel it when you're there. It's a beautiful, it's a beautiful thing. I think the best way to enjoy the Anna Irwin Gardens is to just come out and participate. We are starting to rebuild and rejuvenate um, some of the public events that we used to do. We have the gardens open twice a week, and it's free for you to come in, but then we're also doing uh, public cocktail hours every other month for the rest of the summer, where you can come enjoy the inside of the home and see the gardens and buy a drink. 
Um, but I think really the best way to enjoy the gardens is to bring your events here. Um, we do weddings and bridal showers, baby showers, teas, yoga, corporate events, dinners, graduation dinners, basically any party you can think of, we will host it here. If you would like to stay overnight, host your next event, or schedule a tour at the Inn at Irwin Gardens, visit their website at www dot irwingardens dot com.